The one person I want to hear speak at the Athenaeum is the Dalai Lama. Growing up in modern cities, I have never lived in a place where religion and spirituality are integrated into people's social and political life. I'm interested in hearing how would Dalai Lama describe Tibetan society as an insider, which may contrast with the evaluation based on a modern scientific. And global language, I'm interested to understand the symbolic significance of Buddhist practices to Tibetans. For example, their belief in karma, their unique rituals for funeral, and even the instruments they play in religious events. Even though I'm not a believer of any existing religion, I'm still curious in how spirituality guides Tibetans' behaviors and shape their view of the world. For example. How do they see other parts of China、uh, in comparison with Tibet? Do they have a sense of recognition in identity with the rest parts of China? And to what extent are they aware of the formation of today's global society? I am more than eager to listen to the leader of Tibetan Buddhism describing it from his perspective.、Um, as a Chinese, I was informed. In various sources of propaganda, that Tibet is historically an integrated part of China.、Uh, the Dalai Lama is regarded as causing schism between Tibetans and their fellow Chinese, hence considered as a political criminal. I think the accentuate of unity from the Chinese central government serves purposes more than what has been said, and I would like to hear about. How may certain Tibetans think their identity as members of a nation?